we know about the PAM technology that is used within the data center. And today when we talk about coherent technology, it's a modulation scheme that you use for very, very long distances, 100 kilometers or 1,000 kilometer plus distances. Now, as you increase the speed of PAM inside the building, you go from 50 gig to 100 gig to 200 and 400 gig, the physical distance it can cover shrinks. So let's say 400 gig PAM covers 500 meters or a kilometer. The question is, if you have a one to two kilometer link or a two to 10 kilometer link in a campus data center, what technology do you use? You can use coherent, but that has significantly more power, significantly more cost and latency. So to solve that problem of intermediate reach and provide a solution that gets the distance, but still has PAM-like characteristics of low latency, low power and low cost, our customers asked us to come up with a brand new architecture, and we've co-architected the solution with them, which we call Coherent Light, which uses coherent modulation with O-band optics, which are optics that we use on the PAM side, and we've re-architected the DSP to be able to get the latency lower, to be able to get the cost and power lower, but still keep the long distance benefits of a coherent modulation scheme. So you can imagine in the future that you have very high volume, but shorter distance links within the building doing PAM, you have very, very long links of hundreds of kilometers doing full coherent. And then you have the intermediate links from two kilometers to 20 kilometers that are now coherent light, which give you the distance benefit of coherent, but also give you the TCO and the low latency of a PAM-like architecture.